when looking at this roof you can see these nail pops here and throughout the, the roof here as you can see I can't walk really more than a couple feet without finding them shingles here weren't installed on the lines. This soil stack here is supposed to be flashed with the shingle coming over top of this here just like this one here incorrectly flashed and a vent in the middle of the roof these vents are made to be two foot from the top and as you can see this is quite a few uh, feet down from the ridge line it's probably venting a kitchen or a bathroom vent and the roofer should have installed a damper vent now here's incorrect ventilation system you have a power fan that's also incorrectly installed that shingles should be coming all the way over the flashing to the bottom and not just in the back but you should not have a power fan plus a ridge vent on your roof this makes it to where when the power fan kicks on actually draws air from the ridge vent instead of drawing it from the bottom at the edge your intake vents Now the chimney on this house it's just a wood sided chimney but this counter flashing should be behind the wood and not in front of it as you can see they did a pretty bad job at the top of this they used drip edge instead of a trim metal this front apron flashing should also be behind the wood on this particular home he had an ice dam in this area here as you can see it's only about a foot and a half gutter uh, somebody's been up here with roofing tar and as you can see on this roof you also have nails that have been showing since day one of the install this is just a bad install of this roof Here. and you could also see that uh, they couldn't cut this straight uh, these shingles here should be on the bottom of this this is where they should be installed on this line here These shingles are cracking in different areas and splitting. And this cap and top shingle here is done incorrectly. Now if you look at the ridge vent, it doesn't have an outside baffle. So air and water can be blown into this exhaust. Especially when that power fan kicks on. And if it's raining, it will draw that water right into that ridge vent. And if you look at this valley here, it's just poorly done. See there's still nails on the roof, probably from the original install. See more nails just popping through, even in the front.
There's another one here. I'm Jeff with Triple Peaks Roofing and Construction, and uh, this is just part of what we do. Go out, look at your house, see what's wrong with it, and then uh, come down and tell you what's, what uh, we can do for you.